Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is We All Juggle Knives. I've got two um, micro mini keychain size folding knives today. Uh, these are very small and the price is very low. I got these at GearBest.com. I will include the link. These are going as the SR718, and the black one is the SR718B. Okay, and these blades are extremely small. I have here my Spyderco Ladybug. And just for size reference, uh, you see they're not much longer than the Ladybug, or the, although they are a little bit wider. Uh, if you want to see a close-up of the blade, it's open pillar construction. It is a frame lock, and of course it has an opening hole. Because it is a frame lock and it's small, you know, it's not... It's not the easiest thing to open, but, you know, you can open it one-handed. You see the blade, it's about two inches in blade length. I really like the blade shape because of the utility function. I mean, you can see how this pretty much will behave as a utility knife. Now these knives basically strongly resemble the Spyderco spin, okay? And I'm just going to be honest with you, I really want the Spyderco spin, but the thing is like 70 to $100 depending on which model of the spin you get. I'm sure I'll get one eventually. I'm a big Spyderco fan. But come on, I just didn't feel like getting kicked in the nuts for $70 for a tiny blade. I figured I'd try these first. These are slightly larger, slightly larger than the Spyderco spin, I believe. And I think this blade shape is useful as all hell. I mean, you know, and yeah, they, I mean, I guess you could say they stole it from Spyderco, but, I mean, it's a triangle. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we stole that from the ancient Greek mathematicians. No, I don't know. They had triangles everywhere, dude. It's a freaking triangle. Now, as far as initial sharpness, these aren't really that sharp. I tested them when I first got them, and I, I would give it like a C plus as sharpness. I haven't tried sharpening them yet, but... Given how thin, given how thin they are, I think it would be pretty easy to improve the sharpness. But again, that blade shape, it's all about just using it as a utility knife, okay? So, yeah, for the price, it's all right. Okay, so, the ghetto version of the Spyderco Spin. Do I like it? Yeah, I mean, for the ridiculously low price, sure I do. Do I still want to purchase a Spyderco spin with Nisijin handle scales? Yes, I do. I just, like I said, this month with Christmas coming up, I wasn't going to get kicked in the nuts for $70 for a quirky little, cute little knife, basically. So until then, I'm going to use these. All right, so I'll include the link to these. Hope you enjoyed seeing them. This has been We All Juggle Knives. I'm out.